So we've given some information um, about two triangles, and we're basically being asked to prove that the angles of the large triangle APC are the same as the angles in the small triangle CPB. Now because of the right angles, we can see straight away, we know that the angles in the triangle add up to 180. If one of them is 90, then we can see here that x plus y will equal 90. Now, we'll call the um, angles missing inside the smaller triangle W and Z, and we can see that W plus Z also equals 90. And we have a third angle that shows us that Y plus Z must equal 90 as well because of the right angle at the base of the triangle ABC. Now if y and z equals 90 and w and z equals 90, then, then this means that w, right, these two are the same. So w equals z, so w equals y. w equals y. So this now means then that the angle here is y, and if the angle um, PB Z, this angle here, if that is y, then this means then like, this means that z must therefore equal x, and that proves that the angles in the triangle APC are the same as those in the angle CPB. But just to emphasise again, y z is equal to x. We knew that x plus y equals 90. X plus y is 90. We now know that the angle W is Y, so if Y plus Z equals 90, then Z must equal X. So I hope that makes that clear.